what is up everybody and welcome to a brand new vlog and today as usual i have no idea what we're going to be doing are we going to be trying out the roti today you tell me guys but i'll tell you one thing those drivers around this place do not let the pedestrians walk on the pedestrian walk you literally have to wait for the cars to pass just like over here we gotta run that is a bit annoying to be honest with you anyways we're gonna be waiting for a tok tok and going over to central festival i don't even know why but i started first of all i would like to say a big thanks to all of you guys during the last live stream now we're going to be able to purchase ourselves a car in thailand hopefully on monday i will get some thai driving license and we'll get ourselves a vehicle to drive around i don't want something boring so i'll just get something hopefully old and powerful hopefully it has a jz engine in it you car guys know what i'm talking about that's the type of thing you want to be driving around the streets also a lot of you guys were telling me that i need some sneakers to walk around pataya to actually feel better and the legs to get less tired so the sneakers that i got yesterday they are on me look at them sneakers here we are driving oh look at this guy racing around the place no helmet either on a motorbike genius way to go to heaven guys we didn't even know they started celebrating song grand right now so i brought the new camera i bought two days ago to get it absolutely destroyed in pataya so now i have to hold the microphone so it doesn't get soaked you could see the people there throwing water all over the place and i have no idea how we're going to get to the shopping mall whatsoever <laughs> So we had to pop off the Tok Toks because we did not know that this is going to be happening today. They're splashing water all over the place and I have the brand new camera that is not water resistant whatsoever. My microphone is not water resistant whatsoever. So we hopped off the Tok Tok, waiting for a taxi right now. Hopefully we'll get into the shopping mall. I don't even know why we need to go there, but we came so unprepared, it's not even funny. We need a water gun and I need to somehow, you know, waterproof my wallet and stuff like that. Holy smokes, guys. I should have charged my GoPro and just put it on my head and started splashing everybody with water. Oh, guys, it looks like we're going to be safe in the car. Hello. Hello. Okay, let's see if we can get inside the shopping mall without getting absolutely destroyed by the water. Guys, you could see some kids there with a water gun. They're spraying everybody, not only kids. I would have loved to be sprayed and stuff like that, but not with this camera and this microphone. We need to go to the shopping mall and then go back to the apartment, get changed, buy a water gun and get revenge. Sorry. Mm. You could see people spraying the crap out of people. This is why we took a taxi. Look at this. <laughs> They're saying you should have got a taxi. <laughs> we were the smart ones. <laughs> Some guy got absolutely Evelyn didn't believe me. She's like, oh, we shouldn't take a taxi. There was a guy on the Tok Tok that said that there's water fights going on. Straight away, I'm like, stop the Tok Tok. I'm getting off. We need to get into a taxi. I wanted to go back home, but Evelyn said, it'll be fine. So it's going to be dangerous on the streets of Pattaya for the next week. Thank you. We got to run inside. No, 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 no. No. Oh my god, this is crazy guys. We need to get inside the shopping mall before we get absolutely splashed on. Oh guys, we are in safety right now. We could have get splashed on outside on the streets, inside of a shopping mall. 
is safe right now. We need to somehow get back home, get rid of this gear, buy a water gun and show them how it's done. But I'm start I still have not had any food. It's five o'clock already. I don't even know what to say. Evelina nearly got splashed as well. So we're just trying to stay dry. And for the first day, I'm wearing my sneakers. I don't want to get them wet on the first day. So they would stink up, smell like rotten God knows what. Well, guys, it seems like I have found an amazing hoopty to drive around Thailand. So we're going to be checking it out today and seeing how awesome it looks like. But it looks like something out of Fast and Furious. And if you guys did not know, Fast and Furious is my favorite movie ever. For some reason, a bunch of waiters came over here. I don't know why, but I cannot wait to show you this car. Hopefully we don't get sprayed with water on the way there. Wow, guys, look at this. A robot came over here to bring me a bit of chicken katsu curry. Wow, thank you very much. Oh, this smells delicious. And a bit of miso soup. Let's see how good this chicken katsu curry is. This is delicious. Oh look, a robot came for Evelina. She doesn't even know what she ordered. Oh wow, look at, she got some sort of a combo. And it looks huge. Look at the size of this. You can feed an entire family with this. Meanwhile, I have this little curry with a bit of miso soup that I'm gonna be having. We have finally made it over to the shopping mall. Well, not the shopping mall, the grocery store because yesterday we couldn't make to it. I know guys, we're supposed to view a car today and we are going to do it. But before the store closes, we need to buy toilet paper because it's cheaper in a store like this. And we also need bed sheets, just a bunch of stuff that we need. And we're gonna get that right now over here. And like I said before, I'll explain what my cultural shock was about yesterday. It was about the fact that they don't have blanket covers. They just sell a blanket which has the cover on it already. And you just have to wash the whole blanket, not the cover. Doesn't make any sense, but that's how it's done here, I guess. So what I was talking about is this, look at this guys. So you could buy yourself like a set of stuff, right? But you won't have an actual um, cover for this part of the bed because they sell it as a full case like this. So you literally have to buy a whole thing and you can't strip it off and you just have to wash it. Look what Evelina found, a little, well that feels very nice and soft. Ooh, very nice. All we gotta do is figure out how to wash this. Do you guys have an idea of how to wash this thing? Cause I have no idea. Look what Evelina found. She found the crackers for herself, a bit of prawn crackers that she's gonna eat in one night. And I'm gonna just take myself a small bag of tomato crackers myself. So we're getting ourselves sorted out a little bit here. Look at this. Weapons of mass destruction. Look at this machine gun right here. We need this to take revenge back if somebody tries to attack us. And there's also electric ones, but what's the point of wasting so much money? There's even a pink one. Look at that. Well guys, right now we are driving over to see a Japanese JDM car and see how good it is or how bad it is. I hope it's gonna be good. And if it's good, we might as well purchase it. But not today because I rather have a place where they could like do the documents so there's like no mistakes or anything like that. And I'm just so excited to see the car. So let's keep our fingers crossed. It's gonna be looking, flipping good. Wow guys, so I'm looking for a car and the this guy has two cars. Yeah, engine from Skyline. Yeah. Wow, oh, wow. Unless you don't have, don't have this model, Russia. No, in Russia only beside Japan, oh. we have this model. But I like the, I like this. In Russia, in Moscow, more European, BMW, Mercedes. Oh. I always, since I was small, wanted to 
You need to see it. Yeah. Can you uh, yeah, show the okay. engine and I'll look inside as well. Okay. Oh, smell nice. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh, Wi-Fi. <laughs> Does it eat oil? Uh, a lot or a little bit? A lot. Uh -huh. Eight no. kilometers per liter. Eight kilometers? Yes. A liter? Yes. Oil? Oil. Or if you, you mean fat. You mean fuel? Fuel. Yeah, fuel. Oil is an engine you put oil, you know? Oh, yeah. Like a motul, you know, oh. shell, the oil inside the engine. Oh, that's an engine. Oh, <laughs> okay, let's check the other one. Oh, wow. Uh, this is the fuel heat style, but back one you see in the photo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It still have. Oh, yeah. We have to set. Oh, I see. Wow. This is nice. <laughs> Very dark here. <laughs> oh. Yeah, this is good. No accident at all. Yeah, I could see, yeah. <laughs> oh, this is from Sun, yeah? Yes. Right here. Uh, um, the guys make a uh, color is no good. No oh, good I see. Yeah, the paint job. Can you start up the car? Okay. Thank you. No turbo, yeah? No turbo. No turbo. Battery dead? No. Oh, <laughs> I thought. <laughs> he start every day. Oh. Because he still work as a car wash every day. Oh, <laughs> I see. <laughs> yeah. yeah, sounds good. It's okay, I'm, I'm holding. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I a bit of oil there. You see the water? Yeah. No out? No smoke? Oh, that's a bit white. Uh, Filter inside. Ah, it's okay. You can. Yeah, you can close. Oh, there is the car right there that we're going to be checking out. Oh, this, I like it. <laughs> it looks very nice. If you do, you just drive slow, like. Yeah. <laughs> I think here is better? Yeah, I think here is fine. Oh yeah, this looks pretty cool, I gotta say. This looks pretty damn cool. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, oh, you have to go... <laughs> How, how much does he think it is to cost in Thailand to fix this problem? Uh, no, just this, Only maybe, yeah. Oh. yeah. Not more than 10,000. Not more than. 1,000 baht? 10. 10,000 10, baht? Not yes. more than. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll sit down. The air conditioning works. Yes. Uh, fan, fan, fan. Uh, fan for engine and air conditioner. You oh, yeah. Is it possible if me and him can slowly, I just try the gearbox to go down there? Possible? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I, I, I... Okay. Okay.
Yeah, sideways, yeah. <laughs> Testing. <laughs> I still didn't get my Thai driver license. <laughs> I need to change my Russian license. I'm just testing. It's okay here. And uh, can you ask, does it overheat in this weather? Because it's very hot. Overheat? Yeah. No, no, no. No? no. Uh, what what him? Oh, the, over here it works, yeah? <laughs> and what about... Um, the speedometer works, yes? The speedometer works. The, this work, yeah? Work? Work. Oh, uh, I, I'm not sure, eh? <laughs> You're not? <laughs> I'm not sure, yes, I'm not sure. <laughs> and uh, this window work? Window work, work yes. You can just yes. try. Oh, oh. that one, yeah. Yes. You got a <laughs> classic car. <laughs> okay, let's go outside. <laughs> So the nice people who are selling this car are driving us back home and we're gonna be thinking but you know what i really like this car this is nice <laughs> yeah, <that way. laughs> no problem <laughs> Oh my god guys i gotta buy that car tomorrow i flip it out to he he can even install a turbo on that thing for like 200 bucks so we gotta do this guys we got a car project up in here another day and we are going i thought it's a good idea to make a vlog into one because today we are going to be going and checking out that car during daytime and hopefully it looks as good as it did during night time. Hopefully we're not gonna get splattered with water on the way. So we have arrived over to the place we were in yesterday, checking out the cars. And uh, today we're gonna do like an inspection during daytime where we could actually see everything. And hopefully it's gonna be as good as it looked like at nighttime. Obviously it had a lot of nuances as I could call them because it's an old car and it's not an expensive one. so considering you know all the other car prices found the whole the roof oh can you open yeah, sure. thank you oh <laughs> it's going somewhere because the water go down there. Oh, I didn't see how bad it was. I thought it was like this. But in here, there's a hole, you know? Well, guys, checked out the car. You saw the multiple holes in the roof. And the problem is, for me to really like that car, you really need to change the roof. They're saying that to change the roof and to spray paint, it costs $200. They're saying that they would give me a discount for it, but I just don't know yet, to be honest with you. I mean, you would have to wait for like two weeks for a job like that to be done. Ooh, so I just took a pause, a breathe in and a breathe out to see if we can find something else maybe, because that car is just not gonna work out. As much as I like the way it looks like, something out of Fast and Furious, it has some rust problems and I wouldn't mind if the rust problem would be on a fender or something because you just take another fender, slap it on and spray paint it. A roof, you got to cut that thing out. So that is one heck of a job. Anyways, we're switching to the phone because we will need to go outside and it is sun ground and everybody is spraying with water and we got ourselves some water guns as well so that if somebody tries to attack us, we are going to be defending ourselves, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, switch to the camera. We got the weapon ready so that we can defend ourselves. And I'm recording on the phone so the quality isn't going to be that good. But we are ready to get over to some Korean barbecue real quick. We've got to defend ourselves. Evelina didn't want to bring a gun. She doesn't enjoy this. 
but she does have some glasses on. We're here hiding to see the car. <laughs> we can be spraying everybody. Anyways, locked and loaded here. We have a gunfight here. <laughs> We are completely soaked. I don't know how we're gonna go eat at that barbecue place, but this is hilarious. Having gunfights at a car, everything is soaked. We're gonna do a drive-by. We're gonna do a drive-by here. Merry Christmas, everybody. Who else is walking here? <laughs> it's like we got more weapons up in this tuk tuk. Now all we gotta do is defend it. We're getting splattered by water here. No fighting, no fighting inside. Outside. Yes. Yeah, yeah. join the army. Yeah. 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 That's what I did. That's what I did. We got an army here, guys. Yeah. Yeah. on me in the middle of a fight. <laughs> the government didn't pay enough for yes. these things. What is the it? money from China. Yeah. It, it says made in China. What is this? Here, 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 here. Pick up. Pick up. Buy one and come back. Oh, bro, I'm going to get some food. I'm just on a fight to get some food, bro. <laughs> the government's gonna pay you for fighting. What are you doing? this gun for 200 bet and now people are going to get wrecked because the other one doesn't really work for some reason. I'm soaked in water as well. The other pistol that I got didn't work. I have to get another one. I'm getting it filled up right now. Nice. Oh, you professional. <laughs> Thank you. It's a, oh. Heavy. It's not heavy. Oh, wow. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, look at this gun, guys. Look at this guys, you probably can't see my water is, uh, my phone is soaked. Look at the guy. 
Look at the guys. Wow, look at that sausage. We just made it to the airplane market where we're gonna be having a bit of food. I'm completely drenched right now. I'm so glad I didn't bring my camera with me because it got completely destroyed if I would have went outside with the water fights. Anyways, we got to this airplane market here and we're gonna have a bit of Tom Yam. Um, we literally came out to have a bit of food. Got absolutely destroyed with water, but we got a lot of people back. You can see my Tom Yam. I like my Tom Yam just with shrimp. I don't know why, but I like to eat it with rice. It's really good. And this guy's gonna make me cry from it, I hope. <laughs> Beautiful. Ooh, had a bit of tom yam, a bit of meat, prawns, and Evelina had a lot of food. That was delicious, and we're gonna go back on a tok tok, so that's gonna be a very big water fight. Oh, check this out, guys, there's a van on a truck. This is pretty cool, guys. Fighting. Finally got another roti place. So we finally are gonna be eating a roti pancake. Look, it's gonna be a big one, not like the one that the roti lady made when we were there. It's gonna be different. This is how this is how professionalism looks. This is how you make it bigger. Oh look guys, you got some butter in here, right? Ooh, butter brand new it wasn't even there when we got here and you can see the pancake is slim but it's gonna be very very tasty I know for a fact you could see it bam this is how it's supposed to look like like this it's gonna be crunchy and tasty this is what professional pancakes do in Pattaya the best and I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a very very tasty pancake as well this woman right here behind me uses the exact same ingredients. The exact same. And she's cooking it the right way how it's supposed to be. The one that the roti lady gave us, first of all it had hair and second of all it wasn't good. You, go to, you would go to any pancake person who makes pancakes and they would make it to look like this. This is how it's supposed to be. It's gonna be a bit crunchy and delicious. Probably very bad for you, but it's very tasty. And that is how a pancake looks like. Remember the one I showed you, the roti lady? Didn't look anything like this. The same ingredients, but made by a true professional. The roti lady as well doesn't use the Nutella in Bangkok. She uses some weird chocolate. Here, real Nutella, look at that. That's the stuff right there. That is the stuff. That's gonna be so good way better I could already taste it in my mouth it's gonna be amazing this lady right here is really taking her time but she's making it perfect lotus Nutella and then a bit of a, a bit of condensed milk on top of that bad boy it's gonna be amazing look at that bam bam Whoa, looks so good so so good better condensed milk to make it look beautiful and even tastier look at that and this is how the pancake is supposed to look like look at this thing crunchy delicious seems like there's no pubic hair this time let's try it out mm. this is so good guys this lady should be the popular one. Mm. Check out, check this out guys. McDonald's full of foam right here. 
everybody is just having fights over here. Some people are not enjoying it. Some people do, well most do. Look at all the happy faces. God knows what's on their faces, but it looks fun. Guys, I gotta tell you, I'm absolutely drenched, but this is so fun. It's like one of the best things I've ever witnessed in my life. I'm literally enjoying this whole day and it's gonna be going on until the 19th. So it's crazy and fun. Driving in the tuk-tuks, spraying everybody, everybody spraying you. What could be more fun? Finally arrived back home. Gotta tell you one thing, unfortunately that car I don't think I'm gonna be getting because changing a roof on a car, first of all, probably not that costy, but imagine you have to make it so perfect that the windshield is gonna be able to be placed in there. So that's a big, big problem. So we'll be looking at different cars over in Thailand. On the 17th, I hope that I'm gonna be able to I get some of my papers done that I need to register a car under my name. I'll have to go to the immigration office for that. And also I need some Thai driver's license and that is actually very important as well because it seems like more probable we're gonna find a decent car in Bangkok and not in Pattaya because in Pattaya the price of cars are higher for some reason. So that means we will go to Bangkok to find a car unless a miracle happens and we find a nice car in Pattaya. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you really enjoyed it. Yes, I am a bit naked, so you might as well press the like button, subscribe to the channel, and comment on what you think about the Thai celebrations. I think it is pretty cool. See you later, guys.